Good evening. Welcome to dot programming dot blogspot dot com. Uh, today I will show you how to save cookie into your client browser machine uh, by using the code of such server. So uh, we have a HTTP cookie class through which we can add a cookie into the um, or you can say uh, add cookie into the client browser machine. Mm -hmm. First of all, I would like to share something about the cookie. Actually, cookie is a text file um, which is stored temporarily on uh, onto your client browser machine uh, on your on your browser cache uh, by using the uh, history uh, deleted the, we can also delete the cookies or after some time of period cookies automatically deleted from the client browser actually cookie store some informations like the shopping cart informations uh, like uh, uh, you can say the address city and etc mm, okay uh, so if you want to add the cookie into the, uh, into asp.net c sharp uh, so we have a uh, two methods through which we can add cookie into the client browser machine uh, using the server code uh, the server code is server code is basically uh, designed by uh, using the http cookie class uh, by using the HTTP cookie class, we can directly call the expires uh, expires time and uh, um, cookie. Um, you can say uh, the value of the cookie. Uh, in the value of the cookie parameter, we can save the cookie information like the um, cookie name, cookie values, etc. And the cookie expiration times we can add. Mm, the expiry of that mm, cookie like the date time now uh, add hours uh, etc uh, so if you want to add the cookie into the client browser machine so uh, if uh, we have a only single method uh, that is add uh, of the cookie uh, properties and the cookie property is directly called by the response object so we can call cookie uh, property uh, by using the response object of the page class so if you want to uh, add cookie multiple cookies uh, into the asp.net so we can add cookie mu multiple cookies uh, into the asp.net c sharp using the response object so uh, let's a demo of the applications through which we can add cookies uh, uh, here uh, here i have designed three uh, methods through which we can add cookies the first is http cookie class and the second is a uh, response object and the third is multiple cookies or you can say multiple values into the co single cookie okay uh, the first parameter is uh, save cookie by using the http cookie class that is name and the second parameter is product name uh, by using the response object we can add the product name into the client browser and the third uh, represent to the employee bio data that is name is and the email uh, multiple parameter uh, you can say how to save multiple parameter into the http cookie class so um, in the form you can see that uh, some controls like the button control and that xbox controls uh, let's see in the code behind file what i do uh, to save the cookie in into the client browser machine okay uh, only the uh, single code we can run uh, for the cookies okay let's see in the code behind file first of all uh, create a object of the http cookie class by using the instance name we can invoke uh, the cookie parameter uh, that is the value and etc okay HTTP cookie class that is the customer cookie new HTTP cookie class the name of the cookie and the instance of the cookie class is the same 
Okay. Uh, in the value property, uh, I will also discuss uh, that is the value of the cookie uh, that is comes from the text box one dot text. Actually, the name of the uh, customer. So, uh, customer cookie dot value is text box one do, uh, comes from the text box one, and also set the expiration time of the cookie that is two hour after two hour that cookie is automatically from the delete from the um, browser history or you can say browser cache by using the response object we can add the cookie into the uh, client machine but uh, so by using the response dot cookies the name of the cookie that is product dot value and text box two dot text to save the cookie uh, by using the name of the cookie that is product and by using the response object we can add the cookie into the client browser machine okay the also set the product cookie expiration time um, that expires date time dot now dot uh, date time dot now dot add hours that is two hours create cookie response dot cookies uh, how to add multiple uh, parameter into the cookie that is response dot cookie employee cookie the uh, in the employee bio the first parameter is name text box 3 dot text in the same um, things in the employee bio I will add the uh, next parameter that is age and email so uh, here we have employee bio is the name of the cookie and the three parameter that is name age and email is the parameter okay by using the uh, request method we can get the cookie from the browser so uh, in this tutorial I will show you how to get the cookie from the browser by using the request object by using the response object we can add the cookie into the client browser uh, by using the request object we can get cookie from the client browser okay the same things uh, here I will do mm. so create cookie replace with the get cookie or you can say read uh, reading cookie just uh, using HTTP cookie class remove this by using the request object we can get the cookie label uh, place the label it here uh, the saved cookie HTTP cookie class uh, and the above code you can say the enter name we display after saving onto the label read cookie and the label one Jacob and create cookie I think getting error yeah this page is refreshed but uh, cookie is not saved uh, my 
Microsoft Lumia and multiple values if you want to add in cookies that is employee bio is represent the Microsoft Lumia 920 is not employee bio so I want to add employee bio the name that is Bill age is 22 and the mail is bill at the rate of gmail.com okay that's fine create cookie okay now I want to retrieve cookie read cookie by using the request object when we click on the button string name equals to request dot cookies the name of the cookie pass it here uh, dot value and what's the cookie name that is customer cookie and the name is displayed on the label one Similarly, the same thing apply read cookie. Oops, getting error. Object uh, reference is not set for instance object because the customer cookie is not saved in properly uh, into the browser. So run it again. We in browser. Wait for some times to read cookie. We are getting error. Now assign the name first of all. Tarun is the name and read cookie. Yeah, the name of the display the cookies thrown. okay that's fine similarly we can do for the products similarly we can do for the products product name so thank you thank you very much for watching this video tutorials please keep watching my old video uh, which is later to asd.net um, if you want to move uh, the core of the ac.net please watch my all other video tutorials and uh, in this video tutorials i will not show how to delete the cookie if you want to learn more about delete cookies then please visit my website or you can say blog the programming.blogspot.com okay so thank you thank you very much if you want to delete a uh, simple things uh, i will share you about the delete cookie that's uh, means of uh, expiration time so uh, remove or you can say uh, in a add hour method uh, or you can say add days method we can pass the minus sign to delete the cookie okay so thank you thank you very much for watching this video thank you thank you very much